We've all been hearing about how AI has completely revolutionized nearly every single industry, including e-commerce. Today, I'm going to share how I leveraged ChatGPT to mine the highest potential Etsy print and demand product today. And this is going to surprise you because, spoiler alert, it's not t-shirts. Make sure you stay until the end because I'm also going to share a new free commercial use AI image generator that has completely blown my mind for its potential use in the print and demand space. Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Angel. I am a wife and mama of two amazing kiddos, a full-time Etsy seller, now Etsy print and demand coach, here to give you all the tips and tricks to help you to be successful on your own Etsy print and demand journey. Uh, make sure to check out below. I have a free Etsy print and demand starter guide, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I then created a free chat GPT account, and then I asked the chat box to make a list of best-selling niches on Etsy to sell in. And to my surprise, it did generate a list of 10 top 10 items to sell on Etsy. It included handmade jewelry, customized home decor, handmade clothing, wedding items, etc. None of which I was particularly surprised to see on the list because I already know that these are you know the top selling items on Etsy. So then I asked the chat box a more specific question. I asked it to make a list of Etsy print man niches to sell in. And this is where it got really interesting. Because at the top of the list, it wasn't actually home decor, clothing, mugs, wall art, the things that I expected to be on the list and towards the top of the list. The number one item was actually customized phone cases. And this was really surprising to me and exciting because I know that I can create customized phone cases using print and demand platforms like Printify, for example, to customize phone cases. You can customize clear cases, tough cases, all different kinds for all different types of phones. So then I did a little bit more sleuthing and I went on to E-Rank to see, you know, what is the search volume for um, this product for cell phone cases versus something like shirts. So for just to give you guys, you guys a comparison, shirts um, are searched over 20,000 uh, times on Etsy on average a month, which is not surprising. This is a, you know, one of the highest searched for items on Etsy as far as in the clothing um, category. But there is a ton of competition. There's over 8 million listings. So you do have to niche down in order to be successful, you know, on Etsy in this category because of all that competition. Now let's compare that with phone cases. And this is also, you know, super exciting and interesting. You can see that there's actually over 32,000 searches a month on Etsy on average. So even more than shirts. But look at the competition. There's only 246,000 listings in comparison to over 8 million shirt listings. So it's actually um, more highly searched, but there's less competition, significantly less competition. And you can see that there's just tons of, of um, you know, high searched, but low um, saturated niches in this product category. So it's just a really exciting you know, category to be in. And so then I did go back on to uh, ChatGPT and I asked another more specific question. I asked the chat box to tell me the most popular phone cases to sell on Etsy. And once again, it generated another top 10 list. Some of the uh, ideas included customized phone photo cases, uh, trendy and unique designs such as uh, trendy patterns, abstract designs, pop culture references, uh, personalized names, clear cases with designs, protective cases, pop culture references, phone cases. So these are all, you know, the types of graphics and items that we could create, you know, to sell with print and demand on Etsy. Next, I did some sleuthing on Etsy. And lo and behold, just like it said on G chat GPT, the types of phone cases that were trending were things with patterns, custom phone cases, um, more custom, you know, with dogs. So custom dog cases, some of those trendy pop art, um, famous painting inspired ones. Uh, once again, the Van Gogh inspired, etc. And it, we can see here that this particular listing right here, it is actually using my product analytics, my Everbee Chrome extension. It has sold over 100 times. It's only two months old. And this listing here, using my Everbee Chrome analytics, it sold over 300 times. Um, so there's just tons of really exciting opportunity here. And to create this design here, the floral antique pattern, I would simply just go to Creative Fabrica and type in vintage floral digital paper, and you'll get all kinds of different types of graphics that you can use on your you know, print and demand item, which in this case is a cell phone case. And I do have a referral link in the description box below um, where you can sign up for Creative Fabrica for just $1. This is for an all access trial for 30 days. And then afterwards, you can get it for as low as $5 a month. So this is like a no brainer. I use this um, website literally every day in my Etsy print and demand business. 
All right, so next I went back onto Etsy. And for this one right here, this phone case, you might think, well, I don't have access to really cool graphics like this. Well, actually now, thanks to AI, you do, and for free, which is pretty crazy. So let's go on to um, OpenAI. OpenAI's Daily 2 is a new AI system that can create realistic images and art from a description in natural language. And you can create an account for free, and then you get so many free searches a month before it will ask you to purchase a credit. And I was able to actually create these images by just typing in Italian countryside Van Gogh style. So you could so you can type anything there and put Van Gogh style, and then you'll get this post-impressionist style with that artwork. And you might wonder, well, who owns the right to these pictures? Well, according to OpenAI, you do. You have the right to reprint, sell, and merchandise these photos, uh, these images that you create. And as you can see here, you can create some really amazing artwork here um, that you just simply download to your computer and you technically own the rights to. Now what you have to do is, because it is a lower res um, picture, I just put it into Canva and then I made this one 2500 by 2500 um, and you can, can create a free account with Canva um, using the link below in the description box. And so then I downloaded this higher resolution image and then I placed that on a phone case with Printify so, because once again, Printify is a print on demand platform that will print and ship products for you um, that you don't have to pre-purchase so you don't have to house any inventory. I don't have to keep a stack of cell phones at my house that I'm printing myself and then shipping out. I do all of that for you, which is just incredible to me. And then as you can see here, you've got this cool, amazing case that you can push to your Etsy shop and that you can sell. So let me know in the comments below, guys, if this is something that you would try, if you guys are interested in more AI um, tutorials or any other future YouTube videos using AI for your Etsy print and demand business.